joined here by the victorious Kieran Gething, second fighter middleweight and after two years out of the ring to get those six rounds in, it must have felt pretty good. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it could have been uh, a case of a normal opponent, like my last fight where we are backing off and letting you work, but he, uh, he let me work at times, but he made it rough at times as well. He definitely did it. And a bit of swelling there, a few elbows were thrown in there. It was a bit messy at times. How was it competing against your man? Uh, yeah, it was um, not what you expect. A lot of the time, it was weird because he didn't want to hold when he was inside, but then he was happy to be quite uh, quite gung-ho on like when you break the clinch and things. But yeah, he was, he was a nice, good enough boy. He looked like he had a bit of pedigree as an amateur because he could box, but yeah, it was an uh, enjoyable fight. And you've been through the weights now. Is middleweight the weight you're looking to fight at in the continue of your career? No, light middle are going to go back uh, down to. Going to go back down to light middle and then probably eventually welterweight, depending on the opportunities. But uh, the next uh, one or two is probably light middle. And do you think about regaining the Welsh area or are you looking to move on to perhaps a Celtic, a British? Yeah, so I'll probably end up letting the super lightweight Welsh area go, uh, in honesty, because I just don't see myself getting down there again. Um, but yeah, Celtic title is what I got my eye on next. It's what I've had my eye on for a while, but shit happens, you can't get it every, everything you want. And um, yeah, there's, 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 there's bound to be opportunities opening every time that I get in there because if I keep on winning, it's been a long time since I lost. So yeah, hopefully the opportunities come. And an incredible story. I, I read that you were born with a club foot. Yeah. Can you talk to us a bit about that? Yeah, yeah, it was uh, talipes, uh, congenital talipes. I was um, born with my foot uh, inward facing. I had an operation like five months and um, it didn't really do anything for me, into, uh, to, to me, sorry, to affect me until I was 13, 14. We were in the national squad and I was breaking down with ankle injuries all the time. And it ended up a running joke that uh, if anyone got injured, they'd end up training with me. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's uh, someone I've got on with, someone I deal with and thankfully I, I, I've, I've been blessed and gifted enough and had the best opportunities to get as far as I have. Super pleased with my career so far and there's only more to come hopefully. And you wrote a book as well, so plug that away. I've, I've not had a chance to read it yet, but it is on my on my reading list. Yeah, yeah, um, Insight was my book. I wrote it uh, when I was 25, um, just about my boxing career so far. I've dealt with different things. I'm actually writing another one now, so that'll come out when I'm 30, um, as long as i got another title to hold on a front cover. Well, Kieran, thank you so much for your time, man. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. <laughs>